Here are the best players to pick up heading into week 11. At running back, Arizona Cardinals rookie Trey Benson popped off the page again on Sunday against the New York Jets, totaling just 10 rushing attempts for 62 yards along with two receptions for an additional 25 receiving yards. Benson is not going to overtake veteran running back James Conner, but it's clear his role is starting to grow in each and every week. Benson is one injury away handcuff and can be started in a pinch during the bye weeks that are upcoming. Another rookie running back is Audric Estime of the Denver Broncos. He should be added heading into week 11. Head coach Sean Payton delivered on his promise to get Estime more involved. Estime led the Broncos with 14 carries. In that loss to the Chiefs, incumbent veteran running backs Javante Williams and Jaleel McLaughlin combined for just three carries. This will likely be an unappealing running game, and Estime doesn't project to do much as a fantasy receiver. He's still an interesting fantasy asset and should be rostered in case there is a breakout for the stretch run of your fantasy football playoffs. The Indianapolis Colts rookie wide receiver Adnai Mitchell secured all six of his targets for 71 receiving yards against the Bills on Sunday. Mitchell is popping off the page and gets open when he gets opportunities. His chances in week 10 were due to veteran wide receiver Michael Pittman missing time with a back injury. If Pittman misses more time, Mitchell is playable in deeper formats or in a bye week pinch. Often we see rookie wide receivers start to show themselves around this time. The Colts will face the Jets in week 11, which could be a tough matchup on paper. Mitchell has earned himself a top 50 ranking if Pittman still misses time. Enough with the exciting rookies. A boring veteran that should be picked up is the Bills' Curtis Samuel at the wide receiver position. Samuel looked healthy for the first time this season and was noticeably more involved with wide receivers Amari Cooper and Keon Coleman missing time. Samuel played about 90% of Buffalo's offensive plays, an obvious full-time player this week. His production was modest, finishing with four catches for only 35 yards, though he did see an impressive eight targets. Samuel is far from a league winner, but he is playable as a top 55 wide receiver as your team's injuries start to pile up and the bye week squeeze forces you to look down to the bottom of your fantasy roster. If you enjoy videos like these, consider hitting the like, subscribe, and ring the notification bell to get notified when Rotowire puts up new video content every single day. Let us know in the comments who you're picking up heading into week 11.